morning guys unusual place to start, start the vlog but yeah um, we I woke up quite late because I've just got a bit of a headache um, but we're at the Tristan Elmhurst crap DNA again DNA investigation um, which is really good so we're gonna watch that and then we're gonna do a few other stuff later on so I'll see you guys later hey guys so we just come out the talk now um, we're gonna go see David's dad for a bit and just see how he is <laughs> basically um, the talk was really good don't you think really enjoyed it yep yep cool uh, so we got a shuffleboard tournament later on which should be really really good hopefully gonna just not come last that's our goal <laughs> um, so yeah so we'll see you guys when we get there oh wow yeah we're, we're, we're sort of up against it still definitely the youngest here by a bit it's our competition we're gonna beat it not really but we're gonna try oh wow it's really choppy now I don't know if the camera will do it justice ish so yeah, um, wow it looks really like choppy so it's just a miserable day today. But, oh, my old bed. Oh, memories. Memories. And me. Hi me. <laughs> Simple things in life amuse me. Hey guys, so we've just gone very quickly to the room. Got a hat, done the laundry. Oh, well it's doing it at the moment. Um, good timing done the laundry and now we're gonna go and play some table tennis and practice for the tournament because we're gonna try to do better than we did last time. David's gonna try to beat the old man this time. We've got this. It's not like me beating David the, the other day yesterday. Okay, be great. Eight. Cool, so um, just come back from playing table tennis. It was good little practice. Um, so we're gonna go to the room, wait for our laundry to dry. Where am I going? This way. Wait for our laundry to dry. And then we're gonna go up and get something to eat. Which is good because I need food. Um, and then go play a table tennis tournament. So that's gonna be good. So we'll see you guys when we're there. Or actually maybe when we got food. Probably food. Laundry took slightly longer than we thought. So we're gonna have to rush. Maybe get very something very quick and then, and then go. But yeah, it's gonna be good. And then we're gonna go to this quiz. It's like pointless apparently. So it looks really good. Hopefully we're gonna do well. I think we're just gonna be in the audience because you have to like apply to be at the contestants. None of us have done that, so we'll try. So we're at the quiz show now. So this is it. So less is more. So people waiting. Me and David are entering. We're, we're signing the wings. Yeah. We're trying to be contestants at the moment. Um, the pick names out of a hat, so. We might be contestants, and if we are, I'm going to love it. I'm going to hate it. I'm going to absolutely love it. He's going to hate it. So he says, I do have to do all the talking, and to be honest, we all know I'm going to be doing most of the answers. No offence, David. A lot of it. So, see you guys, and we'll tell you if we're contestants or not. So this is the beautiful membership. <laughs> that was too close. <laughs> Lamborghini. So that was really good. Uh, we had a German guy behind us that couldn't say Lamborghini. He always went Lamborghini. And it was just quite funny. Um, yeah, so I actually got a pointless answer, which was really cool. We didn't get picked, unfortunately. Uh, which I think we would have we would have gone far, I think. The, question, the questions were quite good. Um, one of them was, what fictional teachers? And one of them was Elizabeth Halsey. So if anyone knows that, Put it in, down in there in the comments, not description, I write in that bit. Ish, maybe. <laughs> um, so yeah, now if you get Elizabeth Halsey, tell me. Because that was a pointless answer. And I want a memory stick, so that was good. Yeah, so give me a sec, I'll show you memory stick. So we got some lovely pork scratching, pork, chicken, kebabs I think. And for dinner, for dessert even. Donuts. <laughs> David comes back. <laughs> so David's got the same sweet potato fries as well. He's got some like ribs, noodles, and scratching. I can't believe you came back with scratching. What? Pork scratching. 
cracking. Perfect. Oh. Nice. We've got no chance. Hmm? I just realised it's doubles, Ooh. not singles. Ooh. We've got no chance. Ooh. So that went well. <laughs> I, I got loads of points at the start. What's that? Talking a bit. So, sorry about that. Someone got on the left. Um, we didn't do very well at table tennis. It was doubles in the end, which nor me or David realised. So yeah, we didn't do very well. I think the final score was 11-21. I got a lot of points at the start and we clawed it back quite a lot to like 7-11, something like that. And then yeah, it just went downhill. So at the moment, I'm trying to find David because it sounds very childish. But we're having a game of hide and seek. So this is gonna be really interesting. I'll explain rules later on and after this. But I've got a time limit to try find him, and if I don't find him by time limit, we meet somewhere. So this is gonna be interesting. We're gonna try find him now. So as you already know, <coughs> I'm hiding from Emerson. And at the moment I'm in the library. And I've been here for about seven minutes and Still no sign of him, so fingers crossed he won't find me. Told him mission was a success. Now to get back to the library. Getting pretty bored now. <clears throat> just got eight minutes left to find me until I have to uncover myself, so I don't know if I should just start walking around now. Move hiding spots. I'll just wait here. Oh well, I'll have a think about it. Right, there's only five minutes left until I can find me, so I'm gonna go find him. Right, it's 5 o'clock. Let's go find Emerson. So the plan is I'm going to try to sneak up on him behind him while he's waiting for me. I'm going to sneak up and make him jump. That's the plan anyway. But it's meeting time and he's not even here, so... The plan of making him jump is not going to work. I guess I'll just wait here till he decides to show up. Come on, Emerson. Where are you? You're all meant to do finding me, not me finding you. Look who I finally found! Yay! So it's now my turn to try find Emerson. He's changed the rules up because he couldn't find me. So we've changed it from playing on deck two and three, now just deck nine, and apparently he's got the best spot ever. So he's got two minutes from when he gets to deck nine. And I'm going to come get you, Emerson. Watch out. So before I go look for him, I'm just looking at the map of the ship. And I just know, I just know for a fact, he's going to be here he's gonna be in the gym 100 100 percent i'm gonna go get him now i'm coming for you emerson i'm coming for you got out the lift i walk this way through this door and he was sat right there wow emerson such a good hiding spot if he said to the board so you know how i said i bet he's in the gym where was your hiding spot idea? The gym. <laughs> I told you. Gym I area. told you. So, because he was so bad at that round, I thought I'll be a nice person and I've given another round. So, five minutes of nine, so I'm coming to get you. So, I'm currently hiding. Dave's trying to find me. The last one was sort of a redo because my spot wasn't available. It was a really good spot, but it wasn't available. So, I'm currently hiding. Wait for him to walk past there. I'm going to walk back to the try hiding some corners just cautious and literally whenever he walks in because he could walk into the shop and go oh we could be in here I mean, like i did but i'm gonna go i'm gonna try daringly walk around a bit and see if i can catch me or i can see him well, sir, where are you? so he could be on one of these tables so i'm trying to scout him out from up here so he wasn't in the queen's room so let's keep looking Right, I reckon he's hiding in a proper stupid place, like just sat in a chair. Like in the middle of nowhere, with nobody around him, not blending in at all. So, maybe the cafe. Let's go and have a look.
that's amazing. So it wasn't in the um, in the cafe. Just checking the library quickly, then off to the card room, which I think is the next best it's nest next best bet. I can use the computer as a hiding spot because there's an exit there and I can just duck below it and hope he doesn't come up the stairs. He's walked past me through twice. I'm going to try and risk it. I've got 10 minutes left. Do I? Yeah, I've got 10 minutes left. I'm going to try and risk walking around a tiny bit. Also, I have taken my hat off so it's not as easy to recognise me because nobody wears hats here. So if you spot a hat, you can see it very easily. So let's go. So I've left the library. I've left and I don't know whereabouts he is. So if I very quickly put my phone down, that's why, because I've seen him. I want to try to see him look over, see if he's over there. This is going to be close. Kind of struggling with this one to be fair, not in the card room either. So off Jack Brown to the pub and maybe the casino. Right, I'm really struggling with this one. So my last bet is the pub. So let's go and have a look in the pub. <laughs> Moving on to question number nine about sport. Here we go. Oscar de la Hoya, Jack Dempsey and George Sorry. Well then it goes plan. Not in the pub, literally. Can't think of anywhere else it can be. I'm just gonna have to go through all the places I've been again. First stop on the next, on the same round, but the second time I'm looking for him is the shops. Let's go and have a look there. Probably struggling with this one. I've just got no idea where he is. Literally no idea. I found him. I found him, he's running away, but I'm gonna go down these stairs, but I'm not running because you're not allowed of the rules. But if I go down here. Okay, so he's just seen me, doesn't know where I've gone. So this is gonna be close now. He doesn't know I'm behind him. He's got no idea that I'm right behind him. I don't know why he's running because he knows he's been found. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> Look at him run, it's cute. Hey, so we f he found me eventually. He did find me before the time, so that's really annoying. Um, but it's just so close. It's, it's really good fun, but really tense, don't you think? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sweating after. I was getting nervous when you were trying to find me. <laughs> So, really good. At the moment, we're just chilling. Um, and then, I don't know what we're gonna do. We'll work it out. So I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm not organized. May have forgotten my phone. But yeah, um, sorry I haven't vlogged much today. Just with, I, I know we said in the morning it's gonna be a busy day, but it's just been chilled. We've just been chilling. Um, so now, as you can see, it's a fall night. So, mask masquerade. We don't have a mask, unfortunately. Yeah. Which we should. Yeah. yeah. So we're gonna try and get a mask. If not, fair enough. But we're gonna go to dinner right now. So see you at dinner. So this is the burgers, which are very nice. We might have one of them. Ooh. Wedges, sticky rings, sun fried chicken. Won't be. It's sort of an American night. I don't know if you'd be able to tell that. Beef, beautiful. Onion rings, potatoes, mash. Oh, I'm gonna definitely get lots of mash. I like my mash. Veg, yeah, probably a bother with that. But yeah, wow, there's tons of stuff. 
David Tappe was beautiful. So as you saw from the earlier clip, it was a buffet. It's an American style buffet. David's very happy. Oh, it was absolutely beautiful. They're the ribs that I had. That's the beef and then the sliders there. Absolutely glorious. Absolutely stuffed now. Next thing, we're gonna go to the show. Let's go there now. This is the stage. Uh, you can't really see it, which is slightly annoying. Let me see if I can try to do it for you. No, you can't really see it. Well, sorry, that's a really annoying. Yeah, we're in the cin we're in the cinema. No, theatre. It's soon as it's super busy. It, all these seats will be taken by in about five minutes, I'd say. About five minutes, all these seats will be taken. So yeah. So we'll see you at the end. Hey guys, so we've come out of the theatre now, we're just going to come up and get changed, well not get changed, just relax for a bit and then we're going to go to the picture this quiz, it's good. Um, the theatre wasn't the best, it was it was an alright show, it just didn't, we didn't really like it, didn't make, I didn't like it, it didn't make sense, so yeah it was a bit disappointing. Just see you. So anyway, we'll see you there. We'll see you at the quiz when we're there. So we're off to the quiz now. So this is good. We're gonna win. We're gonna try and win. We're not, but we're gonna try. And positive attitude. That's what we need. Go on, David. Run. A little bit. Go on. At the quiz now, it's gonna be good. Um, we've got people on our team, which is gonna be interesting. So, yeah, hopefully, we won't come last. Hey guys, so we did well in the quiz actually. We got 10 out of 15 in the end. The people that were sat opposite were actually useless, they didn't know anything. David's currently eating some cheese. Yeah. So, um, this is going to be the end of the today's vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, and tomorrow we're here in Venice, which is going to be really nice. We've got a gondola tour and just exploring Venice. So I've never been. So it's going to be a first for me. Um, and it'll be really good. So we'll see you guys tomorrow's vlog. Make sure you like, subscribe. Um, and just... I hope you enjoyed it, so I'll talk to you later. Bye.